What you doing, hon? Picking suckers. Are we gonna record this <laughs> video? Yeah, everybody's been wondering where we've been. I know, let's do it. Let's tell them. Let's go. <laughs> Everybody. Hey, what's going on? It's been a while. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we're we're hanging out in the backyard of my second plot. So remember earlier this year we were talking about the two different plots we were urban farming. Well, this is plot two. So yeah, we're just hanging out out here and decided we, we should do an do... update video and yeah, update you guys on what we've been up to. It's been well over a month since we've done a video and we have even been active on Instagram. So we've just been really busy, right? Yeah, so with Ashley getting pregnant, we decided that we were gonna put our house on the market. And the house we had tenants in, so we eventually got the tenants out uh, kind of in the beginning of May, around like May 10th or so. And from that point on to right now, we're still working on the house, trying to get it ready and fixed up and ready to go on the market in the next couple months. Yeah, so Ben has been working around the clock to get it fixed up. And I've been doing like packing up all of our stuff and then moving us to a temporary um, location until we figure out our long-term goal. Yeah, so we're right now where we are is my parents' backyard. <laughs> that's the second plot, and so, that's where we're living right now. Yeah, too. So, so we're living here right now until we can get the house sold and on the market. The house, there is toxins being used at the house. We had to redo all the floors and when they put a, a finish on, you know, that finish was really toxic. We had to paint the house, yeah. well, the paint fumes were getting in there, so. We didn't want to be around that, and especially with me being pregnant, we didn't want the baby to be exposed to that. Yeah, yeah. So, so we're here, living with my parents, and we'll probably be here for a while until we can get the house on the market, and then we'll update you guys on where we're headed. Yeah, and also with Ben doing like things around the clock with the house, I was, you know, running the microgreens business for the grocery stores for a while until we decided we dropped that um, just because we were super strapped for time. For time. With yeah, we're just, we're trying to get the house on the market, and the microgreens were taking up like three days a week, like full day of cutting yeah. so now we're just doing it on the weekends Ben goes to the farmers markets on Saturday and Sundays and handles it then yep, yep. So. and then what's going on down there <laughs> so I am no longer pregnant uh, baby decided to come early so that is why we've been totally disappeared extra busy <laughs> <laughs> um baby came at 34 weeks and five days um and that was about three weeks ago from today um due date was august 12th baby came july 6th so she was like 34 <laughs> and a half weeks pregnant when the baby decided to show up and out of 40 weeks yeah for those of you that aren't and it's it's kind of a crazy story so i think we we're gonna do some separate videos kind of we definitely yeah yeah and so we'll kind of tell you how it all went and it's like two videos three videos worth of stuff because there's just so much happened yeah i mean given that it was um the baby came early we couldn't do our home birth um, so we ended up doing a hospital birth, so we have a lot to talk about with our experience with that um, and just how everything went, like even pre going to the hospital. Yep. So we want to share that with you guys, um, but yeah, that'll be a few videos within itself just to kind of lay it all out for you. 
Yeah. Yeah. Um, I think I think it we learned a lot from it. Yeah, I think it was something we really didn't expect to happen happen. And the baby's healthy. Yeah. I'm healthy. Baby came out just fine. Um, He's growing like two ounces. It's a boy. To a boy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he's gaining a ton of weight, and he was born five pounds seven ounces, which is pretty big for a 34 and a half weeker um, baby. So. But we'll get into more of that, yeah. you know, in later yeah. videos. But yeah, we're excited. We're parents. Yeah, we're enjoying so we, this time. Yep. Um, but we miss you guys and just wanted to give you an update. Um, we're going to get back in the habit of doing videos as things kind of slow down. The plan right now is to the next couple of videos kind of walk you through the birth story and like what what went down in the hospital and um, do a couple, couple of those videos before we get back into like gardening stuff and right and we still owe you guys a part two of fertility and things like that we're still we you know we had all these plans to do all these different like pregnancy videos and but you know what baby had a timeline of his own and uh came when he wanted to come so it's okay yeah we're still gonna have <laughs> lots of good content and still talk about pregnancy stuff too because i totally. I definitely want to share that with you guys. Um, I find it really important. So, this was just like a quick little update video. You hadn't seen videos from us in a while. <laughs> You're probably wondering what, what happened to them. Well, we're around. Just a lot going on right now. So, bear with us. You know, we got more great videos coming down the road. But, uh, you know, wanted to give everybody an update. People were asking. Yes. Yes, they were. <laughs> All right, you guys, we will see you all on the next video. See you see later. You.